Hello, welcome to the channel Learn to Exist. Today we are going to discuss this problem. We have two chords intersecting at right angles and this length is 12 and this length is 8 and this length is 6. We are asked to find out the diameter of the circle. So first we have to find out this length and how do we find that? We know when two chords intersect the product of these two numbers will be the product of these two numbers 6 times 8 is 48 so 12 times what is 48 12 times 4 is 48 so this should be 4 now i will tell you how we can find out the diameter of the circle then i will explain how we got it so to find out the diameter of the circle we have to take the sum of these two numbers 12 plus 4 is 16 and square of that plus the difference of the other two numbers 8 minus 6 is 2 so 2 square and this will be root of 256 plus 4 and the diameter will be root of 260 and we can write it as 2 root 65 we just need to take the sum of these two numbers 12 plus 4 is 16 and the difference of the other two so 2 and take the sum of the squares of these numbers and take the square root and this is the diameter of the given circle and I will remind you there is nothing special about these two, co these two numbers we can take the sum of these two numbers also 6 plus 8 and 6 plus 8 will be 14 and 14 square plus the difference of the other two 12 minus 4 is 8 so 14 square plus 8 square and 196 plus 64 and we are going to end up with the same number root of 260 now I will explain how we got this how, how did we get that this value will be the diameter of the circle so this looks almost like the problem figure this looks almost like the circle we had now the center will be approximately here now if we are taking the reflection of this code on the diameter it will be like this we can draw another code parallel to the original code with the same length like this so this will again be 8 and this will be 6 and this will be like we have put a mirror here and everything about this diameter about this line will be below this line so we have 8 here and 6 here and this will be 4 this length will be 4 so there is that so the total length was 12 from from here to here it was 12 and this is 4 so this would be 8 so that is 8 now we can connect these two chords and we can connect these two chords and that would be parallel to the original chord that we had so we have now since these two chords intersect at right angle this will also be right angle this will also be right angle so we can call this a rectangle so we have a rectangle and its circumcircle and we know the diagonal of the rectangle will be the diameter of the circle so we am going to draw the diagonal will be like this and what makes these diagonals these two sides right these two perpendicular sides we have 8 plus 6 here so 8 plus 6 and this length will be the same as this length this is 8 so this should be 8 so we have a right angle with this side as 8 plus 6 and this side as 8 so so the hypotenuse of this right triangle will be the sum of squares of these two numbers and sum of squares of these two numbers we have root of 8 plus 6 all square is equal to 14 square and 8 square 
and we have our answer as root of 260 and this is the easiest way we can find out the diameter of the circle remember the concepts we used we took the reflection of this code along the diameter so the code here will have a reflection here with the same same length and again this length is 4 so this length will also be 4 so we have got a rectangle and its circumcircle and we use the concept that the diagonal of this rectangle will be the diameter of this circumcircle now i hope you have understood everything very well now this is the first video on this channel and i will upload more tricks like this in the coming days so please be sure to subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching